Hello everybody, um, just to remind you, these news reports are not real. Enjoy! Alright everybody, this lag is ultimate disrespect to this news. So, ladies and gentlemen, let's get right. It's the news! Right, uh, so I've just realised something that has shocked the BPL forever. As you know, Peter Cech, the god of English goalkeeping, has absolutely taken a big step in his career. I'm wearing this Chelsea to my jammies. It's because... This is a part of it! Yes! Peter Cech is going back to Chelsea! And guess what? How many they've actually got for him? They have actually got 50 million! 50 million? That is absolutely amazing, guys! 50 million! 50 million! 50 million! You know how much that is? That is the half of the continent of Europe. That is absolutely amazing. Like, I'm not a Chelsea fan, but I am absolutely devastated. Like, wow, how have they done this? I've actually got a news report on a... on a lad that does have the right tactics on the scores. And this lad is absolutely devastated, just to warn you now. Okay guys, I'm getting this through my phone. Let's see what it's going to say. Right, where is it? There we go. What's this? There's been a bit of an embarrassment. I can't believe Peter Cech has actually made this deal with Arsenal. I wonder how this is going to go for, um, for Arsene Wenger. Arsene Wenger is also devastated that he, he lost 3-1 against Wolfsburg in the Champions League and that has actually cost them a few points. They were doing so well with Peter Cech's. Cech's, what? Okay, I've messed up already. But yeah, they won, they, they got two they won two games in a row with Peter Cech on. They won one against um, <coughs> Hamburg. No, not Hamburg. Um, St. Rhines. And they won against Ajax. And they've now lost against Wolfsburg. Unlucky boys. Keep on it. You need to get a new keeper, you rubbish idiots. Wow, strong words there, him. Let's see what Arsene Wenger has to say about this. So, lads, yes, let's see what Arsene Wenger has to say. Let's do this now. Let's do this. Well, I think um, that... We've just been playing poor football in the league, you know, um, I'm just really, really annoyed at the team. 2-1 against Wolfsburg, nothing really special. Um, Giroud came on, tried to prove it, done rubbish. But um, we actually had to get a defender to score and Metisaka did that. Um, it was pathetic, uh, I, I thought. Because Danny Welbeck was playing rubbish, we had to pull him off in the first half. He, he missed uh, five goals. Yeah, well, he missed the penalty and he missed four shots, four open goals. Absolutely devastated. And um, I've been eating chicken curry, sorry. But then in the mm. second half, they yeah. somehow just they somehow just put themselves in it. And um, a new goalkeeper. I think that's Ospina, rubbish goalkeeper. I'm not giving him a contract anymore. I think I might sell him, but that is just poor 
people from the team. I don't want to see that anymore. And um, yeah, that somehow this man just scored two goals. It's absolutely devastating. I just hope this doesn't happen again. We need a new keeper. Might need Sensi. Shut up! Wow. Okay, strong words there. Um, I never thought the manager would say this, but yeah, it's it's turned out like this, I'm afraid, guys. And I wonder if this um, I wonder if uh, if anything's gonna give in their next game. Let's get right into the second news. Right. So there's been a bit of benefit. What breaking news? One second. Lads, this is the big one. Donald Trump really got his walls fixed like. He's got his new wall in the bathroom. He got what he wanted. He needed walls. He needed walls in the bathroom. And now he had that. Do not get elected. Right. Okay. Just stick to your walls in the bathroom, alright, son? Lads, we are going to switch over to Johnny Haldishin. He's going to give you the sports news. Let's get right into the sports. All right, the sports today, lads, is the big one. The big one, Man United take on Everton. It was a huge match and United pulled it through 3-1. Well done to them, boys. And the second one, PSG bit. Reyna's um, 4-0, brilliant, they're on top of the lead now, they're winning on goal difference, which is absolutely fantastic, um, their new deal with um, Falcao is going to come through next month, that would be absolutely brilliant, and now let's get right into the big match it is, yes it's Aberdeen, Take on Celtic. Yeah, the big game. Everybody's been waiting for it. Especially me. I'm a Scottish guy. <laughs> okay, so the, the final score. Cracker of a match. Guess who won? It was... Celtic, give a round of applause. Celtic managed to pull through. Um, Lee Griffiths, he, he took a penalty. He knew what was going to happen. Um, so, yes, this has been your boy. It has been your sporting. And let's get right into the studio. Right, you. It is time to end this. I was supposed to be King Star, but I just had some banter. Alright, so don't judge me. PS4 controller, gonna play. Um, well, I'm just gonna go on to the live action. You know, you know, because I, I just watch boring matches. Right, I, I'm just gonna watch this game. I don't know. Why? It's Leeds. Take on Nottingham Forest. This is going to be a cracker. But this, uh, I watch boring matches, but this isn't boring. Alright, so guys, hope you leave a like. Please subscribe. And please leave a comment what you thought of this video. And please leave a comment what you want. So yeah, lads, let's get right into the TV.